What's going on everybody? How you doing? How you been? Oh gosh. Today is something I've been planning for so long ever since I moved in here. You guys probably already know what it is. Oh god, it's so hot. I'm sweating like a meatball. I know, meatballs don't sweat. More like a bacon. But not that tasty. Okay, so today what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna have a tour around my super small condo unit. What you're about to see is where I spend most of my time after class or whenever I'm not going anywhere. This place is designed by my girlfriend, Guy La Villanueva. You can go check out her Instagram and anyways, let's get on to it. So let's start off with the kitchen. My kitchen is pretty simple. There's a microwave on top of the fridge, and on top of that is a rice cooker and a kettle. And it's like that because, as you can see, I don't have much counter space here, so we had to make a do. <laughs> Next to that is my super awesome induction cooker. I love this thing because it cooks my meals super fast to the point they get burnt. Just how I like them. <laughs> Then I have a couple of utensils over here as well as a holder for my cooking stuff because you know, cooking is my forte. Dawes cooking vlogs are coming soon. I'm kidding. Here is probably the most helpful thing in this area. It's my plate holder where I put my plates, obviously. And then there's the sink. Probably the busiest place in the kitchen. Also, the dirtiest most of the time. Moving on to one of my favorite spaces in this room is this clothes rack area that Kyla got me. She even told me what to put on there and all that. Underneath that is my gear bag and my guitar. My two worlds combined, because you all know I'm into those stuff. Music and film. Oh, okay, yeah, enough about me, sorry. Next to that is my almighty bed where I spend most of my time sleeping and, you know, <laughs> watching Netflix. Yeah, nothing special. A throw blanket, two pillows, and two cute throw pillows. On the left side of it is my side table. This actually was my eating table at first, but now it functions as a side table. My Yeezy box is on top of it for aesthetic purposes. Not for flexing. As you can see, there's also a fake plant on top of it, and a Sonny's case, and my bracelet. Again, for aesthetic purposes. Also, my video games are inside this copper container thingy. Kinda cool. And my favorite is Kyla and I's graduation photo. So every time I wake up, I get to see it first in the morning and get inspired to get back to sleep. No, I'm kidding. Above that is my ukulele, hung next to a comic strip-like thingy which Kyla bought for me. It says, hello, and it's very cute. That's it, it's just, it's just cute, that's why it's there. Under the table is an extra blanket for some friends who wants to sleep over. And next to that is my brand new extension cord, so I don't have to get up to charge my phone anymore. Next is my cabinet, where all my clothes are inside, of course. On top, you can see a storage box where I put some miscellaneous items. Next to it is another photo of me and my girlfriend. Yeah, as much as possible, I want to uh, imprint this house with Kyla's photos so people will know I have such a beautiful girlfriend. And then there's the telephone. And then on top are other stuff for aesthetic purposes, which include a print Kyla got me that says, hustle hard and stay humble. Again, it's a nice reminder to wake up to. I also have an air freshener, which I set up to spray the room automatically every 30 minutes. And then here is my workspace. Uh, I won't go on full detail here. I'll just flash it because I'm thinking of making a workspace tour. So comment down below if you'd be interested in that. Anyway, that is it for the video. Here's a drone shot for my outro. Like and subscribe. I'm interesting. I promise. And if you guys want to follow me on a daily, go check out my Instagram. It's at underscore dos Santiago. And go follow Kyla as well. All of the links are going to be down in the descriptions. 
thank you so much for watching. I still don't know how to do an outro after a year of doing YouTube.